Thanks for logging on to WCBI.com. I'm meteorologist Jacob Dickey with an update on our weather, which looks like a wet forecast for us. We get some rain on Sunday. Keep another chance of rain on Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday. Get a cold front to push on through Friday night, bringing us rain into starting our long holiday Christmas weekend. Now let's remind ourselves we are in a moderate drought right now. That's going to be for all of our area. There are burn bans that are starting to pop up. Starkville yesterday issued a burn ban. Other municipalities are banning burning. If we don't get the rain, we'll continue to see that. But we will get some rain. Maybe by the time all of a sudden done, we'll get enough to wrap that up. For tonight, though, clouds will increase. After midnight, we start to see the showers moving to the west along I-55. I think for those us in the Golden Triangle, they'll hold off until about 6 a.m. or so. The best chance overnight to see that rain. Again, on Interstate 55, Oxford, Grenada, Winona, perhaps even the Pontotoc, Ackerman, Eupora, Kosciuszko will likely hold off the rain east of US 45 and in West Alabama until the day on Sunday. Here's our future cast showing that. There's that rain move on in, that heavier rain at times coming into the entire area by 730 in the morning. So if you're heading to church or heading out for Sunday morning, you want to grab your rain jackets and be ready for that. That rain's going to hold around through much of the morning on Sunday in the Golden Triangle and two blue areas. It may clear out by an Interstate 55 by lunchtime on Sunday. But we'll keep the chance of rain through much of the day as scattered showers are possible through Sunday afternoon, particularly along the south of US 82 and in West Alabama. The other thing to notice is notice we don't get any sunshine really across the area. Maybe some peaks mix in along Interstate 55. If that is the case, then I think we'll get those highs up to near 60 for folks in Grenada, Kosciuszko, Winona, Carthage, Golden Triangle. We've got us in the mid 50s, Tupelo area, low 50s, West Alabama, low 50s, even upper 40s in a few spots as the rain holds on and the cloud cover stays in. So we'll be dealing with that rain through the day. We also will look at the southeast winds from 8 to 14 miles an hour. There'll be some north winds off to uh, Memphis coming in as that, that stationary boundary moves in. But keeping the rain chance on the board through the entire day, have those umbrellas handy. And really, this is a forecast we haven't had in a long time. Seeing rain potential such as this, three to four inches are possible by the time we get to the end of next week. And that's because we get wave after wave after wave moving on through. Seven-day forecast has rain almost every day. Got rain for Sunday, Monday, maybe a brief shower, uh, especially south of US 82. I think the Tupelo area stays dry. Tuesday, Wednesday, we get more rain moving on in. Thursday might be our one dry day of the week before our cold front moves in. Friday night bringing us a chance for rain yet again on Friday, followed by a rather big cool down to start off our holiday weekend.